Hey, most of y'all know me, know that I don't do a lot of processed sugars. I try to use honey where I can. But the other day, I told Bobby, it's okay to cheat every once in a while, and you can slip up and have processed foods. Just don't eat them all the time. And when it comes to sugar or stuff like that, sometimes you can have a shake or a malt. And we were at Brahms, and Bobby got a shake, and I said, you need to get a malt. And he said, what's the difference? Well, you take malt, you can buy it at the grocery store, and it's just like you, you mix it in when you make a shake, and it makes it so much better. Today, I'm going to show you my own secret recipe that's going to be out in the open now for everybody to enjoy of Tex Willis's Killer Malt. What did you say when you got that malt, when you had a taste of mine? It's amazing. Very amazing. <laughs> but this is even better than Brahms can do. First, Bluebell ice cream. You can't go wrong with Bluebell. Get it right out of the store. It's still kind of soft and you can scoop it up pretty good right in here. So we're going to put us some ice cream in here. Now, if you're going to make a shake, you just add milk and go to town. But we're going to make a super shake. Not yet, Bobby. No. We're going to make this into a malt and add a few more ingredients. So we get some ice cream in there. That's good. Now we need a malt. So open up your malt. We're going to put a few spoonfuls of this in there. Because what's the malt make it? Amazing. Amazing. Okay, that's probably good on the malt. Next, if you really want to sweeten it up a little, sweeten condensed milk. Oh, this stuff is nectar. I'm going to tell you, this is sweet and it's good. Okay. Now, how many of y'all like double stuffed Oreos? Check this out. Take the middles out. Real simple. Twist them apart. Take them middles out. I got 10 of them. What are you going to do with all these cookies? Give it to somebody with a little baby, like a one-year-old. Them babies eat them, and they like them, because they don't know they're supposed to have the good stuff in the middle. But we're going to put it in our malt. Next, rich and creamy vanilla frosting. Whoop up a couple of spoons of that in there. You really want to make this rich and thick and creamy? Bobby, get the milk. Put some milk in here. Put the milk. That ought to do it. Let's take it over here to the blender. Got my Ninja blender. I'm gonna blend it all up. Like I said, this is the Tex Willis Killer Malt. Try that, Bobby. Good stuff. Good stuff. 